Hey everyone, welcome back to my channel. My name is Sahar and today is going to be a review of the Sky High Maybelline, wait, the Maybelline Sky High Mascara. I did review it over the course of maybe a week. I also did compare it to my favorite Holy Grail mascara, which is the L'Oreal Lash Paradise. This is the Sky High Mascara from Maybelline. So it does come in 7.2 mils and it does retail for about like, I'd like to say $10. I can't remember. So when you open it up, it does does twist nicely and what I like is like you know how these like it's raised so it's easy to open and close unlike my lash paradise which is like it's just smooth so sometimes when my my fingers are sweaty or wet it's hard to open so when you open it the wand is super flexible since the wand is very thin um, compared to the Lash Paradise anyway, it's so much easier to get to each of those hairs at the bottom lashes. I find with the Lash Paradise, since it has a thicker, bushier wand, it does get a little bit messier, especially down here. I find this does give me a lot of lift, not so much volume. You can see here versus me not having mascara, you can really see the difference. So you can tell the difference between the L'Oreal Lash Paradise versus the Maybelline Sky High. The Maybelline Sky High does give me a lot more lift, but the Lash Paradise gives me a lot more volume. First test is the crying test. So this day in particular, I did cry because um, I did get lost somewhere. So I did cry and I was wearing the two. I already know that the Lash Paradise will not flake on me. The Sky High is not waterproof. I did expect some flaking. It wasn't too bad though. Face wash test. So I do this test because when you remove your makeup at the end of the day, typically you'd like to rub less around the eye area. So if you do get a waterproof version, then it will be a little harder to remove versus one that's not waterproof. And we know, we Lash Paradise gals know that it is tremendously difficult to remove the Lash Paradise from your lashes. Here I am trying it with the oil-free acne wash cleanser from Neutrogena which is one of my favorite makeup removing cleansers and you can tell it completely removed the sky high and I kind of expected that because this is not waterproof and the lash paradise is there's still remnants of the lash paradise on my lashes so I did wear the sky high for 12 hours because I know the lash paradise and how it performs it will not flake, it will not smudge for 12 hours. I've tried it in the beach, I've tried it in the swimming pool, I've tried it everywhere, I've tried it even in the gym and in the shower and it just, it stays on, it's locked in. So I wanted to see how the Sky High would perform, noting that it is not waterproof. And I have to say, it's pretty damn good and it kind of, it kind of lowered a little, like the lift wasn't there the whole day but it wasn't too bad and the mascara is still intact there's no smudging there's no flaking and i think i have found my new favorite mascara the thing i like about this versus the lash paradise is the wand is easier to handle for the bottom lashes and it is easier to remove as well. It's kind of gonna replace my Lash Paradise because it's easier to remove and it still looks fabulous and it still stays on all day. But if it's something more intense like a workout or the beach and if I wanna wear mascara and look cute, I'm gonna be going for my Lash Paradise. Thank you so much for watching everybody. I hope you enjoyed this video and found it helpful in any way. Don't forget to hit that like button if you liked the video and subscribe down below if you wanna see more from me and from my channel. I hope to see you in my next video. Bye!